Well, hey guys, Jeff here, Project Next. Thanks for stopping in. As you can see, I am loading up. I've got another project to do, and this one is at my daughter's house. And by the way, just to let you guys know, I am going to be a grandpa again. Yay! And uh, it's going to be the first grandson of the clan. I have four grandgirls, and this is going to be the first grand boy. So anyway, my daughter has asked me to come over. We're going to do some stuff in the nursery. So I got some really cool stuff with some shiplap we're going to do. So guys, come on. I'll show you what we got. <music> Well guys, as I'm headed over to my daughter's house, I just wanted to say a big shout out to the first timers. If this is your first time checking out our channel, welcome and thanks so much for stopping by and checking us out. Our channel is all about knocking out projects one at a time, whether they're indoor or outdoor, and whether I'm working at my house or working and doing some of the projects over at my kids. Uh, it's just all about knocking them out and learning stuff as we go. Uh, every time I do a project, we learn something new, and I always try to share that information with you guys. You know, uh, in today's world, it's getting tougher and tougher to find contractors uh, to come and do these smaller type jobs. They're just so uh, slammed with big projects. So for us as homeowners, we need to work to become more self-sufficient, and that's what our channel's all about. So anyway, guys, thanks so much. I hope you will consider hitting the subscribe, share, and like. And also, don't forget to grab the notifier, and uh, that way you'll be sure not to miss any upcoming episodes. So anyway, guys, as you know, we're doing uh, work with Shiplap today, so uh, I'm going to finish heading over to Brooks, and we'll pick up here shortly and start working on getting this stuff installed. And uh, again, thanks for stopping by. All right, so Brooke wants to do one wall in um, Little Jackson's room uh, with uh, shiplap. And so we went over to Lowe's yesterday and visited. Uh, I had her come with me because I wanted her to see the products. I thought she would choose what she ended up doing, but I wanted to show her a couple options. One of them was a tongue and groove, and the other one was a pure shiplap. It come uh, in eight foot lengths, 12 foot lengths, uh, the wall we're doing is, is a little over 11 foot, so obviously we got the 12 foot boards and they were already um, uh, primed in white. So we got them home yesterday and then Burke went ahead and got uh, the first coating. Obviously, uh, this is just to start working to cover uh, the white primer. And also the main thing is, is we wanted to get down into here where this will be overlapping because you won't be able to get down in there good with the brush later. So this is done and ready to go. So I'll go upstairs next and I'll show you some of the preliminary work we got to do before we start cutting boards and actually installing them. All right, so now we're up in the nursery and uh, one of the things that we want to do to get prepped is we need to find the wall studs. Uh, one of these cool devices that I've gotten, it's a wall stud finder and it works really great. And so we will go and measure and mark where all the studs are. We're gonna mark the walls and then we'll get our measurements and we'll start cutting the boards. Obviously we're gonna be putting these on horizontal and we're gonna be covering just this one wall. So guys, you know me, let's get busy.
Okay, on this wall, there's only one tough cut board and that's the one I'm working on now. And it's not even a big deal, but it's the only thing we gotta work around is this one receptacle. So as you just saw, I just took my time, laid the board up there, got me some really good marks and measurements. And so I've got the receptacle marked out here. And so I'm gonna use this awesome saw uh, that is one of my favorite tools to work with for trim work and working with uh, light wood and working with sheetrock especially. And we're gonna cut this out. So guys, we finished up all the installation of the shiplap, got everything done, got all the trim pieces up, and I got the uh, electrical outlets uh, taken care of. And so now, fast forward uh, a few days later, and uh, my daughter was able to get all of the um, nail holes filled in, sanded down, and then she put on the final coat of paint. So we are headed over there now, and it is time to do the big reveal. So come on, let's go check it out. Well, okay guys, I'm gonna swing the camera around and show you guys the final reveal. I think it turned out really great. I love the way it all come together. This was a fairly, very easy project, especially with having Brooke to help me. But uh, again, since I was here last, we got all the boards up. She's come back in and done the filling, uh, did the last coat. And then I also, one of the things I had to do was this board, I think it's like a quarter of an inch thick. And so I had to get the adapter uh, to where you extend the receptacle out. I think it's called not an adapter, but an extender. And we moved this out. And then we also did these trim pieces on the side to do the molding to make it all kind of frame it in nice. And so let me get back up and give one more. So this was a real nice project to accent a wall. And I thought it turned out great. Please let me know in the comments what you guys think. I'd be curious to hear your feedback. So anyway, guys, another project done and uh, moving forward to the next thing. So uh, as always with uh, Project Next, there's always one more. So guys, please be sure to uh, hit that like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to grab the notifier. 
And I uh, hope to see you guys on another video down the road. Thanks so much for stopping in. So guys, I'm going to finish up for now. Uh, again, thanks so much for watching. You guys have a great week, and we'll catch you later.